Welcome back. The South Carolina Gamecocks ended last season with five straight losses and did not play in a bowl. You know the old ball coach is ready to get the winning ways back in Columbia in 2008. One place he knows he will get production is with wide receiver Kenny McKinley. He was one of the best receivers in the SEC last season, but as Jen Hildreth found out, Kenny sizzles on and off the field. This could have been a very different summer for South Carolina's Kenny McKinley. After a stellar junior season, the Mableton, Georgia native thought about taking a big payday in the NFL. But for McKinley, he just wants to enjoy the college life a little bit longer. Yeah, I can't lie, I was thinking about it, you know, it's money, but then you can always, it's always just one year. You can always wait one year and come back in college, man, it's the best time of your life. I got some goals I want to set. Break some records and uh, ju just just start a foundation and, and be the one I can say, well, we started, we started winning SEC championships that year, my year when I came back. The road to the SEC championship will be a tough one for Kenny and the rest of the Gamecocks. But team goals aside for a moment, McKinley has a chance to etch his name in the Carolina record books and replace Sterling Sharp as the Gamecocks' all-time leading receiver. Now, do that guy's name up there? Yeah. Sterling Sharp? Is yep. there, are we going to see your name up there on a plaque? Yeah, hope, hopefully you'll see mine up there one day. And, uh, after this season, hopefully it'll be up there. I come out here sometimes, and I just come out here like it is today. Nobody really out here, and I just look at it and like, man, Kenny McKinley, all-time leading receiver. I mean, that's that's a big accomplishment. Not yeah, too many people can say that they they've accomplished. And uh, one day, I hope my name is up there. If McKinley is going to make it to the top of the receiving charts at Carolina, he knows he's going to have to continue to work hard in the off season on all the little things. That's the jam. All right, Kenny, so say I'm a DB trying to cover you. How do you get open? How do you beat me and get past me and catch the touchdown? The first five yards is, is the main point of, okay. of getting open. Everything I do, I try to like make it seem like I'm going the opposite way or I'm really going. If I want to do a slant, I might just work my feet a little bit, fake like I'm going to, to here, and I'm coming back this way. Okay. So it's all about dancing. So I try to get up on you? Yeah, yeah, that's what the DB gonna do. The DB gonna try to, okay. they gonna try to get in your grill and all that. All right. So they get, if, you, if you're quick enough, you can leave him standing, hitting the air, and you run right past him. Call this a double step. So I'm gonna work my feet, right. give a hard step here, <laughs> and I'm coming this way. So you think I'm coming, when I get a hard step here, uh -uh, and I'm gonna come back this way. Yeah, okay. come back this way. All right, now don't tell me what you're gonna do. All right, I'm, I ain't gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna tell the camera what I'm gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna listen. You run around the slant again. <laughs> you, and you just try to you just try to guard me. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> That's how yeah. you get him at the line. Dust you work it. your feet. Work your feet. Man, your feet do move fast. So what are <laughs> what are some of like the little drills that you've done or things you've done to get better with your footwork since you've been here? Honestly, I'm gonna tell you the two thing that, that really got them better is playing basketball. Yeah. Like if you get a ladder and do just just ladder drills, just know you this way. Just, just working feet down the ladder. All right, we know you have to catch the ball, obviously. Mm -hmm. So once it gets to your hands, Man, how do you take thing, care of it after that? The first thing is our instinct. Every time I catch the ball, I'm trying to tuck it away. Some people, they might use their body to catch the ball, or, or I don't know, some people catch like this. I just try to try to catch the nose of the ball and make sure I get the ball and then tuck it away. I fumbled one time since I've been here, and you, you don't want to come to the sideline after making a fumble. So every time <laughs> I catch the ball, tuck it away. If you had to do a little dance, I know you can't now, but if you had to, you, you said you got the footwork. Oh, I got the can, footwork. Can you break man. it down? Lean with it, rock with it, lean with it, rock <laughs> with it, lean with it. You know what I'm saying? I do all this. We we, we walk it out. I need some music to walk it out. When we go to the house, I'm, I'm, I'm going to put some music on. We're going we to have a dance party. Cause this is what we do. We we cook out. We we eat good. We just bond that team, and we dance, man. I'm going to show you when we get to the house, and we're going to put some music on. We're going to dance. 